Following their open date, Louisiana Tech is headed back to work. The past nine days away from the gridiron were spent healing, coaches observing players, and most importantly, tightening up the mistakes that have haunted this team. I think a lot of guys don't like that we had an off week after that. You know, a lot of guys ready to get back out on the field, and we need to just improve on a lot of different things, especially on the defense side of the ball. You know, we need to improve on our tackling because we're there to make a lot of the plays, and we just – don't make them. With Conference USA electing to move rivalry games to the middle of the season, the Bulldogs battled Southern Miss this Saturday, a program they dropped two straight to with the Western Division on the line. We've got to look at it like this game is for the West. You can't go to the end of the year and go, oh, wow. I mean, if we would have known that, well, I mean, we would have prepared different. When the Eagles arrive in Ruston, they'll bring one of the top three offenses in the league, led by running back Eno Smith, who's second in the CUSA in that category. He's got a great understanding of what he's trying to do and the way he runs routes because he has a great understanding of when he's in one-on-one -on -one situations, when he's facing zone situations. One thing Coach Holtz would love to see is having his guys avoid those third and unmanageable situations in offense. Southern Miss comes into this one ranked in the top five in Conference USA and holding opponents on third down at 31%. They kind of will, will bring the house and play almost zero coverage uh, where everybody's manned up and they can bring one more than you can block. The athleticism they have at corner and in the secondary gives them the freedom to be able to play some of the man coverage. 